Well, hello and welcome back to the channel from Monday 19th of February. Today, I'm just pulling out of our space at iPort. It's a busy iPort, it looks like they're queuing down the road at the moment. We got our container on on Friday, so we don't have to worry about all that. We can just head round and get on the road. So we've got a, we've got a half past nine Nesba this morning we have. 20 footer we've got a company called Craven Co. Don't ring any bells to me, it sounds like a new one to me. But doesn't look overly that bad. So yeah, we've got the container on on Friday, but it was fairly quiet-ish. We just pulled out of our space. So all is good at the moment. They like say the queue, the app, yeah, they are queuing down the road. Surprised they haven't put them in front of us yet. Well, they've only just started queuing down the road though. watching for the roundabout and to see if there's any cars coming up on the outside of them there's another wagon that's next there we go we're out on the roundabout so we're currently 58 mile away from the job here so it's not booked till half past nine it has us there at about 8 40 at the moment so we're good on that that's one of, that's one of our subcontractors there as we're building up our temperature this morning I think we're just going to have a steady day today this is back into iPort at the minute the empty container where we've just left and if it's as busy as that when we get back then well, I don't think we're going to be doing a great lot are we to be fair but we'll see it sounds solid as this box like it could be handball as well so it could be a couple of hours tipping it as well you know so if they don't start it till half nine out for half eleven Grab some diesel on the way back, it's gonna be two o'clock before we're back here. Just be box off and box on for the morning. So we didn't start till seven o'clock today. Just coming up to 7.25 currently at the moment. On a bleak Monday morning. I can't remember, I don't think you can make its mind up if it wants to rain or not. It's just a drizzle at the moment. But we'll find out soon so we'll get on the way get some miles done and um, find out where this week takes us now uh, making good time we are making good time we're just coming to 10 mile away coming 20 past what 8 22 it currently is at the minute but a good clear run we're just taking it steady really I say it's not due till half past nine this container so we might see if we can get a lay-by out before we go in for 15 minutes if there's any lay-bys or just stop short on the industrial estate for 15 minutes get there about nine o'clock then just to um, play it safe because the company looks like there's a gate that runs across the front of it and it's their car park there they're only thin that's down end of the estate so they've got a gate across it so they'll probably be coming in in the cars and that until nine o'clock. So if we plan plan to get there for like nine, we um, can maybe avoid all the cars and then there'll be people there ready for us to get straight in. Is the current plan I'm thinking, but we'll certainly see. And a lot of people don't pay attention to wagons flashing them in anymore. They just sort of live in their own little bubble at times. But never mind, we should be okay for the first job at the minute. Get this one under our belt, get this on time, and then to see where the week takes us from there. There's still no word on what's happening after this. I imagine it's just going to be summit for tomorrow, is my guess. But we'll see. We'll get to this job, let them know that we're there, and we'll see what they get planned for us after that. Oh. Well, one mile away from the job turning right here at this roundabout now, this is a new one for me i've not done this job before i'm going to take both lanes at this roundabout though just 
because I've been over it before. It does get a bit narrow on this side, so we'll take the road. Keep everybody safe. In the biggest of roundabouts either, but we're around. So we're up here and we're going left at the next roundabout, it's saying. Doesn't look like the sort of place an industrial estate would be though, does it? Can't see it through the trees to say we're point eight of a mile away. Oh. We'll trust the sat nav. Say it doesn't look it's a bit odd to me, does this, but oh, I think I can see the estate. Real lights now I can see the estate, I think. It's just further around this road. roundabout so so if it is wrong we can at least try and get back but you can see a bigger building down there you see where we're heading yeah they're all on our left now that's all right then we'll turn left in 0.3 of a mile onto man's lane not the smoothest of roads like well we've been down a lot worse I'm sure we'll go down a lot worse again as well before long. So we're turning, just coming up here in a second. Where well, that car's just gone. See, so I couldn't get, there were no lay by before the roundabout. So we've had to come straight to the job and have to wait for traffic to clear so we can actually make the bend. There we are. We can get around now. the estate and then we we'll turn left again and it's straight down there on the right is where it is where we're heading and again not the biggest of entrances to the estate uh, no I need to be further down actually yeah it's not that one I've seen Travis Perkins I remember seeing that earlier on Google we need to be down here Need to be down this one. We can get through. Yeah, Craven there, big sign. With all the parked cars. Hygienic storage and handling. The hell. Just doesn't seem right, does it? They've got a few places here. Craven though. Private road access to Craven only. Where are we heading? Where are we going? I'm guessing in here. We'll get took over. So at least cars can get past. And we'll just straighten up a bit more. Took it over. So I'll go off and go see somebody, see if we can get in straight away and see how long they're going to be, then let the office know and then we'll be able to find out what's happening after this job. So we're needing to reverse back here, go up the hill that we've just come down and then we can get in on our good side then which is a bit bad because there's pretty vans everywhere but you know I ain't gonna get in at this pretty van there's a van right on corner this is knackered it ain't the best we've been a lot we've been I've been worse places like but we've been back sandwich shops here as well you see at the minute everyone's getting the sandwiches in because we're trying to get round we have to go up on curb here we're not going to have a choice to be honest we'll manage it though we'll manage it a little bit of the grass as well come on, come round 
at least halfway around. If it gives me ten. If it lets me get out of the way, I can get round. Yeah, I needed. I only needed a little bit. There we go. We're round. Yeah, they ain't got the best of yards either. To be fair, in here, where we're going, it's a bit congested. So I say it's about 13 and a half ton on this. So at least we've got the weight on our side, in a sense. It said about three out, three three hours ish tip. So that's fine. We can't even get in because there's a wagon right in. Right in entrance way. It's one I let in as well. So we're not gonna have to wait for them to move. I don't know if I'm best. I'm gonna shrink this, I think. Give us a second. So we'll get it shrunk back. And then we're at least shorter for getting in. Controls are on other side on this bloody trailer. They're always on other side at minute. Because it's got a generator underneath for, for, for when we have fridges on and that. But never mind. So we'll get a shrunk back. And at least at least we're shrunk back and we'll just have to wait now to get in so I'm gonna get off I think and get this in here because it ain't the best reverse just so I can concentrate and I'll pick you up when we're inside getting tipped and all sorted so we are in getting tipped we've just come in from where that tree is we've had to just sneak through we've actually been here a little while now it's coming up to Quart to um, quart to tw uh, eleven, sorry. So we're just getting tipped for the forklifts at the minute. About they said about three hours. It's all handball, so we'll wait for further instruction after this and what we're doing. But I think it's just back to iPod at the minute still. Right, so we're tipped. Finally, coming up to quarter past twelve, and well, we're doing what I thought, parking up. We're going to get this off at iPort and then that is us packing up because we have box we need for the morning for a place called Concert that they've just sent through now it's up Durham way isn't in at Freightliner um, Doncaster until 2 o'clock in the morning so that's always nice it's always fun but after we, we sort of knew it was coming didn't we so don't sting that bad I suppose in the end it's just one of those we'll just get this off and parked up never started till seven so we're guaranteed ten hours so get parked up yeah it wasn't that bad a job in there it was an absolute pain in the ass getting in like in the end very lot very fiddly and it was very fiddly getting out as well because there's not much room in there but we managed it we didn't cause any damage so we're in and out in and out, no problems. I'll try and get out of here, but we can't see all. On the left, is so we got a bit of a view. There's a van coming down. This one we're turning in, but it's cat. We'll wait. We'll wait. I just couldn't see van properly. What we're doing? We'll go after van, and then there's a grey car. Let's go. There we go, they've let us out. So happy days on that. And that is us away. So yeah, I don't know what we've got in concert in the morning, but it's just a short day. You know, we can't help it. We've just got to try and get on with it, haven't we? So we'll get down to iPort, get this container lifted off. And then if it's sunny like this, we get out on a walk. Uh, I could do with getting diesel, but I just do it in the morning to be honest, I just can't be bothered. I'll be a little bit bothered. We've got 23%, so we'll make iPort again. And then um, and we're laughing. Yeah, the truck's going that way. 
Yeah, just going that way. It's that bit VBS that probably just sent through as well. The midnight, while six o'clock in the morning, VBS of Freightliner. So it's living the dream. Start to a Monday, but oh well, it's just quiet at the minute. I, I knew I knew I won't be doing another job after this anyway. I knew it was going to be this this one and done. So we'll get on, get the miles done on way back to Iport and we'll call it a day and get packed up. Getting down to M62 now, seeing what we've got for tomorrow. It's a nine o'clock job up at concert in the morning with a 40 footer at some furniture place. And then reload out at Workington for three o'clock up past Carlisle at uh, Cumbria Waste Management, so a recycling place. That's back down to Newland Wrights at Tinsley. So we should have a full day planned for tomorrow. Uh, depending what I port's like when we get there, we'll get box off tonight if it's rammed. Well, this afternoon, if it's rammed, we'll probably just say sod it and get it off in the morning. So just lost momentum and motivation today. It's just it's hard when you're trying to start week out and then you just get nothing. You just, <laughs> you don't get any idea. You know, you do one job and go back to your base and that's it, done. It's, it, it makes you a bit, a bit tough for the rest of the week, but you've know, got to try and get on, haven't you? And hopefully it picks up, but it's just so quiet on roads everywhere. Look at it, there's hardly all on roads at the minute. It's weird really weird but we're about you know sat nav says 22 mile but i'm not going down a1 i'll go around i'm not messing about going down oh, shit, it, traffic oh dear me but we'll get on we'll get down to iport and we'll see what it is from there if we can get box off it'd be nice it makes it easier for tomorrow just have to go grab diesel in the morning at Morrison's and then we'll go get the box on but we'll see how it looks when we get down here and we'll go from there all right we're in an iPod good old sunny iPod bright on that concrete though it is bright we've been here about 25 minutes waiting to book in it's sort of shift change at the minute but I still no word on what time the box is in in the morning for this job up at concert. Um, I'm half tempted to try it like quarter past five, something like that, because I have a feeling it's going to it's going to be a good two and a half, maybe three hours up there. It's, it's pretty much Newcastle way, but sort of inland a bit further. It's sort of nowhere. And then we've got that reload on the back of it at oh, Cumbria Waste Management over at, I'm trying to think, God, I can't bet my brain, is, I've just lost there, just lost motivation today. Just sort of switched off already, working to, that's where we'll be heading. After this, yeah, it's shift change, all lifters are at the front when we come in. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get off and end this video early and just get parked up pretty much it's all there's left to do we'll get diesel in the morning i'll be bothered getting that tonight and then uh, that's it really there's not a lot else to do it's it's a poor start to the week but hopefully we can pick it up and try and get back into the swing of things but we've just got to try and end a bit positive i suppose aren't we but it'll be what it'll be won't it so i'll get off and end this one here and i will see you all in the next one